a 40 kN axle load is applied to a short wooden post that is supported by a concrete footing resting on undisturbed on undisturbed soil. Determine part A the maximum bearing stress on the concrete footing. Part B the size of the footing for which the average bearing stress in the soil is 145 kilopascal. Before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. Also, match the like button, comment, and share our video, and you get 10 years of good luck. Try it, it works. Alright, without any further ado, let's begin. Okay, so here's the figure for it. So you have a post, wooden post, and it's supported by a concrete footing. And concrete footing is resting on the undisturbed soil. Okay, and you have to find the maximum bearing stress of the wooden on the concrete footing and the size of the uh, concrete footing. Okay, so this is the diagram for it. I just redrew it. Alright, so the maximum bearing stress on the concrete footing is equal to the force divided by the area. So the force is 40 kilonewtons. So I have 40,000 newtons divided by the area, and the area of the post is equal to. And so we have to, as you can see, we have a square surface area. So the area is equal to 100 times 120. Okay. Then I got 3.33 megapascal for the bearing stress, and that is that is also the maximum bearing stress for part B. So this problem is kind of easy. So for part B, you have the uh, you need to find you ask to find the dimension of the concrete footing. Again, mm, the normal the bearing stress is equal to the force over the uh, divided by the area. Okay, so the force the force is so you apply the force on the wooden post. So that force is also distributed on to the concrete footing so we have also we also have 40,000 newtons divided by now for the area it it is different for the concrete so the area for this one is uh, width times the length times width and we have the same so we have b times b which is b squared and that is equal to the maximum stress which is 0 0.145 newton per meter squared square meter so for b i got b equals 525 mm okay so that is your final solution that's it